like skipping, Henrietta. Oh, I used to love it when I was a girl. Um... Oh, come on, Henrietta. You can go faster than that. <laughs> faster! Faster! All right, all right. Sorry, God, stop! Oh, I'm turning the road for my seriously weird art! Oh, what would that be then? <laughs> oh, you made me jump! <laughs> so, you think I'm seriously weird, do you? Well, are you? Come on, Henrietta, your turn. What? You mean me? Jump all of that? Oh, yes. Don't you worry. I'll turn the rope very slowly. Well, OK, then. To start with. <laughs> oh, no. Bossy Bill. I can't let him see me skipping. Oh, look, Great Aggressor. Uh, pterodactyl. What was that? That was a pterodactyl. <laughs> a pterodactyl? You mad old lady. Oh, yes. It was definitely a pterodactyl. <laughs> Did you see it go? Uh, uh, come on, Bill. Uh, we've got an appointment with uh, your school headmaster. Phew! That was close. It's all right, Henrietta. You can come out now. Well, I can't say I blame you for trying to avoid that horrid boy. Let's see you jump, Henrietta. Oh. <laughs> That's my girl. Now let's try it a little bit faster, shall we? <laughs> this is actually quite fun. Telly. Well, 
No break time for you, then. Ever! Oh, wait a minute. What's this in my pocket? <laughs> Maybe we should pin this on the notice board. You horrid boy. <clears throat> on second thought, Henry, I'll um, uh, let you off your homework <laughs> this once. <gasps> Ralph, where's your homework? Uh, I haven't done it, miss. What? I was at dancing class, miss. With Henry. <laughs> yes! We roll! <laughs> Ten minutes, fifteen seconds. Hopeless. <laughs> Henry, Ralph, <laughs> what do you think you're doing? Nothing, sir. Yeah, nothing at all. <laughs> Six laps on the field. Both of you, go! <gasps> Where did you get that? Oh, just somewhere. Yeah, maybe uh, everyone else would like to see it. Henry? Yeah, shall we call them over? You worried boys. Oh, I don't really feel like running today. I oh, know. I got uh, running itis. Oh, just two laps, lads. Are they actually kissing? Ugh, I feel sick. Okay, okay. <laughs> you win. Mm, like, aren't you making them let run, sir? No! Oh, that's not fair. How come they get away with it? It's so easy being me. I'm Mum says happy hippos live in Happy Hippo Valley. Really? How fascinating. And Mum says happy hippos are happy all of the time. Really? And how does she know that? Mum knows everything. I bet she doesn't know that the happy hippos are really weird werewolves in disguise. No, they're not. Yes, they are. Think about it, Peter. Have you ever seen happy hippos at night? Well, no, but that's because I'm not allowed to watch television at night. No, Peter. It's because at night they turn into weird werewolves. No, they don't. Yes, they do. We are snappy, snappy werewolves. <laughs> Time for phase two of Operation Weird Werewolf. <laughs> Excuse me, Henry. I need to brush my teeth. Henry? You're reading a book. Mm, it's a really interesting book. What's it about? Promise you won't tell. I promise. It's called The Werewolf Spotter's Guide to Spotting Weird Werewolves. Really? I borrowed it from Dad's bookshelf. It's a very scary book. Really? Yep. Tells you all about how to spot a weird werewolf. Ooh. Uh-oh. How long has your hair been like that? Like what, Henry? Like curly. It says here that curly hair is the first sign of turning into a weird werewolf. Does it? Have you uh, noticed any other signs? Um, what kind of signs? Let's see. Second sign of turning into a werewolf, itchy hands. Third sign is sharp teeth. Have you brushed your teeth yet, boys? Time to brush your teeth, Peter, yeah. if you dare. Oh. All set for bed, honey bunny. Mum, do I look any different to you? Different? No. You're still my perfect little honey bunny. So I don't seem any... hairier? 
<laughs> Actually, your hair has got very curly. Maybe we should cut it soon. Night-night. Sleep tight. Don't let the bugs bite. that's been stuck in a tree. Oh, all right then. Can I just borrow it? Just for a day? Half a day? An hour then? I'll swap it for anything you want. Hmm. You still got your gross class zero comic collection? All of them, including the Super Bumper Smilly Snotfield edition, when Sam Snotfield defeated the evil emperor three times? Oh, yeah. Definitely got that one. It's a deal then. One hour only. But you'd better look after it. Oh, I will. Nothing's going to happen to it. Don't you worry. Phew! That's a lot of comics. Awesome! Oh, this is so cool! Remember, Henry, you'd better look after it. I will! in this park. Uh-oh. We'd better take our plane somewhere else. <laughs> Come on, Steve. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Race you, Henry. Yeah? My way. You scared. Yeah? You're on. Start here, yeah? Through the woods, the fountain, across the buttercup meadow, finish with a fly through this tree trunk. Yeah? Uh, are you sure that's a good idea? Oh, yeah. I knew you'd check it out. No, I'm just worried about your plane. Mine will be fine. On your marks, get set, go! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, watch where you're flying, that thing. <laughs> Whoa! Mayday! Mayday! Hey! Get back! Oh boy, drop it! to get Mummy Dearest to buy me a new one. What are you going to do, Henry? What am I going to do? It's so easy being me. I'm hard, Henry. <sighs> Where's the toaster? Oh, no toaster, Henry. It uses 1,500 watts of electricity an hour.
There's something wrong with the TV. 30 watts an hour. <laughs> Don't worry, Henry. There are lots of things you can do without electricity. Oh, look! I found my spinning top! <laughs> Don't be horrid, Henry. The sooner you get used to our greener lifestyle, the better. Put an extra jumper on, Henry. <laughs> hey! Just saving energy. From now on, we're going to go to bed when it gets dark. What? It's not even five o'clock! Good night, Henry. You are the worst parents in the world! Don't you join us? We're making toys out of scrap paper. Look, I made a bunny! Great! Why don't you make it a cardboard nappy too? Don't be horrid, Henry. Look, you could make a paper aeroplane. Oh, I suppose there's nothing better to do. Whee! <laughs> <laughs> Now let's take it all down to the recycling centre. I knew it was too good to last. What are you doing in there? Waiting to go to the stupid recycling centre. We're not driving, Henry. We're walking. And saving five litres of petrol. Oh! <laughs> See, so you're looking at the Windomatic 5000. Is it a windmill? Kind of. It's a wind powered turbine that makes electricity. Electricity? So it's good for the environment and everything? Oh, yes. It's a completely green machine. Doesn't harm the planet at all. You wait up! That's it! It's so easy being me. I'm brushing your teeth if you don't want to. Yours disappointedly, Henry. <sighs> Who was your biggest fan? To perform? Of course! We're going to be ready to perform! Otherwise, my name's not Margaret Millicent Mordia Smythe! Is it? No! Now, take five while I warm up! Again! La 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 la! La la la! Hang on a minute! That looks like Henry's writing! Ed Banger, mean, horrible parents, I have to stay in every night to do my homework! <laughs> I don't think so, Margaret Millicent Mordita Smythe. Time to pack up, boys. Hey? We're out of here. Got to post a letter for Henry. You what? I do have to brush my teeth, otherwise my mum nags me something rotten. 
<laughs> Even Ed Banger has to brush his teeth. <laughs> cool. Good afternoon. Um, we're the Zero Zombies, and we're here to celebrate my granddad's birthday. Oh, One, two, three, four. Wait! Oi! Where do you think you're going? To sing with the Zero Zombies? No way, Henry. I'm the lead singer with the Zero Zombies now. Oh, let me through! Henry, you made it. Told you I wouldn't let you down. What you got there, Henry? Rock stars, homework. Just follow me for the changes. When nothing's going wrong. 